All right, here's the make good for earlier. I uh, didn't have those temperatures on there for the weather watchers. Josh and Marion station 38. George and Pollen blocks them at 40 and Chucky and Lewis calling in with 42 degrees. All right, let's go to this uh, seven day forecast. That's going to be a chilly one, but a dry one dry weekend, dry start to next week. Winter starts Wednesday. That's old man winter there, by the way, and we've got rain coming in Thursday, potentially cold enough for some wet snow. That's for all of Delmarva, Brandon and Devon. We've got a lot to track. Stay tuned. Hey, shout out to Josh and Marion Station. He's always calling in with those weather temperatures. All right, well, thank you very much, Rich. You thought we were done with football here on the shore. Well, we are not because mm -hmm. tomorrow is a big day. It's the annual Crab Bowl returns. The Bayside well represented on Team Washington. Ken Island Bucks will send Casey Heath, Keegan O'Brien, lineman Jeremy Smith, Decatur will be sending Luke Murgott, and Queen Anne's will send KJ Smothers, along with offensive lineman Nate Ford. And Easton will be sending their QB, the Duke commit Kevin O'Connor, and Y High sending the, their trio of QB Darius Foreman, wideout Malik Leatherbury, and the head coach Isaiah Tyler, uh, Taylor. He's going to be the head coach for Team Washington. Yeah, it's exciting stuff. It's going to be taking place here on the Eastern Shore tomorrow at Decatur, 1.30 p.m., and we will have highlights for you tomorrow night on 47 ABC. And that's going to do it for us tonight, but from here, everyone here at 47, thank you so much for tuning in. Be sure to keep up with us all weekend over social media so you can get the highlights from the Crab Bowl. That's right. We'll see you next time, everyone.